Elsewhere on the trade front, the U.S., Canada and Mexico are apparently moving closer to a deal on a new NAFTA agreement. Kayla Tausche tells us about that tonight. Speaking in West Virginia, President Trump expressed some optimism that a NAFTA deal could get done. We're working very hard on NAFTA with Mexico and Canada. And, you know, we'll have something, I think, fairly soon. But he downplayed reports that there could be a deal reached by next week's Trump Summit of the Americas meeting in Lima, Peru. They said, oh, let's have NAFTA before. I said, don't rush it. Take it nice and easy. There's no rush. We get it done right or we'll terminate. Time is running out for a deal to get done. Any agreement faces a lengthy approval process in the U.S. Congress. Elections are upcoming in Mexico and popularity there is growing for the anti-American candidate. And U.S. midterm elections could also create uncertainty. Negotiators from Canada and Mexico were meeting with American counterparts in D.C. Here's Jared Kushner entering USTR's office with Mexico's foreign minister this morning. Speaking to reporters from Quebec, Prime Minister Justin Trudeau also sounded optimistic. I believe uh, we're in a moment where we're, uh, we're moving forward in a significant way. Uh, hopefully, uh, there will be some good news coming. Sources say the three nations are getting closer to a deal on the amount of U.S. parts in automobiles. And there has been progress on reducing protections companies get for investing in foreign countries. White House advisor Peter Navarro says it wants to cut trade deficits, but the ultimate goal is free trade. When it comes to trade, the, the vision here, the strategic vision, is to get to a world uh, not dominated by massive trade imbalances uh, driven by unfair, non-reciprocal trade practices, but rather to a world of free trade. Top trade negotiators have a dinner scheduled tonight and plan to meet again tomorrow. But even if an agreement is reached, it would be in principle only, with much of the fine print still to be worked out. For Nightly Business Report, I'm Kayla Tausche in Washington.